every day in each and every way But feel like Chris Saints, you I'm super fly, now watch me levitate Welcome back to another video. Today's segment will absolutely be crazy. I am your boy J Elevate Family and we about to levitate. If this is your first time peeking through the channel before you leave subscribe. It's free. We have the best content over here on this channel. Now today we will be doing a shoe review on a Nike Dunk Low that almost sold out and it definitely sold out in my size. The box does read Sequoia Alabaster size 11. Y'all already know, personal pair. Now when you open up the lid right here, you do get this nice paper. And yes, we are going deep sea fishing today. Absolutely, family. Now y'all already know, man, when I get the shoe, that's when it's time to do the review. No fake shoe reviews over here. And I present to you the Nike Dunk Low, AKA Rainbow Trout. Absolutely, yes, sir. Now, I want to say this. A lot of ugly sneakers over time go up in value. Don't hold your breath for this silhouette, but hey, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Let's jump right into it. Now, on top of the toe box, you do have this nylon material, and you also see those spots, okay? And you do see those spots on a rainbow trout, all right? You absolutely do. And on the bottom, of the toe box right here to include throughout the whole entire shoe Nike I am really surprised that y'all use some nice suede material on this silhouette I'm not mad at y'all at all I'm absolutely proud of y'all for doing that now on the Nike swoosh right here I hope y'all can see that iridescent colorway also you do have the Nike swoosh that is supposed to represent the scales of the rainbow trout now on the heel tab right here, it is orange with that Nike stitching in orange as well. And you do have that lavender colorway right here, okay? And for this silhouette, it didn't come with a second spare laces. And I'm not mad about that all for the 110 price point. But I will say this, man. In my opinion, I think they should have gave us some lavender laces or maybe even yellow, something crazy because this shoe has a lot going on and I think it would have represented the shoe just a little bit better. Now on the tongue of the shoe, you do have that nylon material and the tag does read Nike Beaverton 1972. Now, you already know man, the old days are gone, long gone. So this is all you get, you don't get a shoe tree, but I wanna show y'all the interior of the shoe, the sole of the shoe, all right? So it does match the heel tab right there. Now, the midsole of the shoe as well as the outsole of the shoe is all white. I really wish Nike would have gave us some wild colorways for the outsole of the shoe. I think it just would have complemented the better the shoe a little bit better. Just just my opinion, all right? But a lot of people said this shoe was ugly and they were not copying the shoe. Mostly because people are going to tell you, hey man, what can I wear this silhouette with? But don't worry, your boy got you. Check my resume, not the type to hesitate. No nah, boy, you can't estimate. I'm heavy, you featherweight. You still stuck on yesterday. I'm thinking about better days. You sit down and take a break. I sit down to meditate. Why, why you trying to run my race? You going to hyperventilate. I'm crossing through the interstate. I, I cross through the finish lane. I, I'm the one that changed the game. I, I'm the one that entertained. By the end, you know my name. I don't do it for the fame. Do it to get out the pain. I do not mess with no. Before you leave, like, share, subscribe. Hit that post notification bell. Because every time your boy drop a brand new video, I want y'all to get the latest and greatest. Now, you know the model. Mm-hmm.